Rebooted. Bangonomics. Rebooted. Welcome to another Bangatorial. Um, I've uh, been gate crashing um, a cyclist's uh, party, <laughs> uh, a cyclist meeting, uh, in effect. Um, uh, I hope you enjoyed my uh, display uh, on the uh, uh, Bangonomics bicycle. Um, as you can see, I don't wear Lycra. Uh, I don't wear a helmet, unfortunately, which I, I don't when I'm on the road, so uh, that's silly old me, really. Um, and I have hobnail boots on as well, rather than those um, shoes that you strap yourself to the uh, pedals with. So um, I'm a cyclist from the old days, really. Uh, I'm an old fossil of a cyclist. Um, so what happened was I, I didn't sort of uh, hack anything or do anything illegal, but uh, I managed to come across a link uh, where uh, local authorities asked parish councils uh, what they think about various policies. And this one was about uh, cycling and walking policy. And uh, I thought it'd be interesting to uh, pop along and see what they were saying. Um, it was a, a Zoom call. Um, uh, there's a link uh, in this video where you can uh, go and watch it. Um, uh, I'd only watch it if you have insomnia problems. There's basically uh, a couple of blokes reading out policy documents. Um, at the end, you are allowed to ask question. Uh, I didn't know how to use Zoom to put your hand up. I think you had to go on emojis or something, so I couldn't do that, but I could type a question. And I asked, was this related to 15-minute cities, the uh, policies that they have? Uh, they said no, um, that would be on the local authority um, website. And it is, but you do have to dig around uh, for it. Uh, basically, what we've got going on here um, is an agenda to get us out of cars and uh, walking and cycling. Uh, they're very much on board with uh, stated government policy, which is by 2030, 50% of all journeys should be on a bike or walking. Um, now, this was to do with a place where I live, Norfolkshire, and it was linking up uh, towns. So they're coming up with routes, uh, safe routes for walking and cycling to uh, join towns together. So that if you want to go from one to the other, you should ideally go on a bicycle. Now, in Norfolk, I would say the vast, vast, vast majority of cyclists are recreational ones. They're the ones who don't dress as I do. They're uh, they wear Lycra, uh, they're doing their Strava thing where they're seeing how quickly they can do a certain route. Um, uh, or it's people out together uh, on a, you know, on a, uh, a fun day out. Um, they're, not, they're, they're not commuting, they're not going from uh, one town to another to do shopping, to uh, do a school run, uh, to do business in effect. So it's... Uh, I don't know, it seems very ambitious of them to think that 50% of journeys, which is quite high, isn't it, um, could be carried out on a bicycle or by walking. So basically what we have here, we do have the, the agenda, the agenda of getting us out of cars uh, and onto another form of transport, uh, or actually it's not even a form of transport, is it really? Um, I'm constantly being told that I, you know, I'm sort of worrying uh, uh, too much about these things. But no, uh, things have really moved on exponentially, I'd say, in the last um, six months, um, certainly when it comes to the 15 minute city thing. So um, this was like just a bit of a glimpse into um, how they see the future. And the future is apparently uh, on a bicycle or on Shanks's pony. Um, there's nothing wrong uh, with cycling or walking, but being forced out of your car and to do that, um, you know, without anything else being in place, it's not as though, especially where I am, there are buses or trains, there aren't any, there's nothing. If you don't, you know, I constantly keep saying this, yeah, if you don't, if you don't have a car, you don't have a life and that's what we're moving towards. But there you go. 
Um, I went and listened to these people. They're very polite, um, but uh, it's quite it's quite scary um, in that uh, this is moving very fast, and local authorities are linking up um, towns and cities to make them easier to get to by bicycle. But in practical terms, I don't think people will be doing that late at night. They may not be doing it during the day. Um, it just seems like a uh, a policy we didn't ask for um, so uh, that's basically it yeah I'm on a bicycle and uh, depending how I cut this I might be riding away on a bicycle or riding towards you I don't know I'll do something clever or well, I'm not very clever thank you for watching like and subscribe as people say it doesn't really matter because only three people watch this uh, thanks very much Kenny good night Rebooted. Bang and on.